Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing Lethe Episode 1. This is an episodic horror game that just released yesterday. It is retailing for $15, and it was developed by Faber Interactive and Coco Studios, uh, which are both two guys, and then there's like uh, two sound designers, a character artist, a uh, music composer, and a writer. So, pretty small team of people. Uh, I've heard really, really good things about this, and the screenshots look very impressive. If you're wondering what Lethe means, it is Greek, I think, for forgetfulness or amnesia. So I've heard that this is a very amnesia, the Dark Descent inspired game. So that sounds like they gave it a similar title as well. Let's go ahead and start a new game. My name is Robert Don, and I was born in London. I used to write this sentence countless times in my childhood years, and I remember father desperately trying to teach me calligraphy. He was persistent as a teacher, yet always a caring father. When I grew up, I became a journalist, allowing me to escape his parental grasp, to live a life of my own. A whole new world had opened itself up before me, and I took the leap without a moment's hesitation. Times were rough back then, yet I was enjoying every single moment my new life had to offer. It was then that I felt it for the first time. It is said that you only get one chance to live your life to the fullest and break free. But when my father passed away unexpectedly, he left behind insurmountable debts, thrusting me into the abyss. My zeal was tempered and my mind clouded. While cleaning up his personal belongings, old memories of him came back to me as if waking from a deep slumber. As I touched the yellowed practice sheets, I wondered how long it had been since our last writing session together. Underneath the sheets, I found an envelope, and inside it was a letter faded with time, which I carefully unfolded. What was written inside shook me up completely. What I had considered to be my life, my whole existence, was shattered beyond recognition. Press Xbox, type SX to continue, which I'm just going to interpret as E. Ooh. It worked. <laughs> that day, I lost everything as if it had all been part of a theatrical shadow play. According to this letter, I wasn't even born in London, but somewhere far from here. The unfamiliar postal stamp revealed at least that much. Frantically, I searched the attic, but no matter how hard I tried, I couldn't find anything else about my past. This letter must have been the only thing my father had kept. Perhaps he had secretly wished for me to find it after his passing, as if seeking redemption. Was I really looking for the origin of my story, or was I just chasing a dream? A cheap excuse to abandon my old life in search of a challenge. Something or somewhere to test my mettle. Just a few of the many questions that occupy my mind as this little boat rocked, drifting slowly towards my final destination. Was hoping for voice acting, but this is fine. Okay, we're off to a rocky start. Guessing we got shipwrecked or something. Maybe not. The music is very amnesia-like as well. Ow, dude.
Okay, here we are. We've got like a health bar and stuff. Zero out of five. Zero out of nine. I'm not really sure what that's for. I'm sure it'll tell me in the tutorial. Okay. Game looks really, really nice, to be honest. Just aesthetically on point. Okay. My dear friend, when the time is right, I will personally make the final arrangements for his departure. The arrival of the supply boat is due next month, so you should have plenty of time to make preparations before he arrives. I trust you will keep your word and will see to it that he will get a proper life far removed from the pain and sorrow that awaits him here. I seek no forgiveness for what I've done and couldn't manage to do, but I do hope that one day everything will be remembered if only as a dream's mist. Take care of my little boy, Robert. Alright, so I've got uh, one out of nine, so I guess there's uh, nine notes to get in this area. You can jump! And you can sprint. Happy day. <laughs> there are so many Steam horror games that I play where you can't do either of those. Sometimes you can't even crouch. I do like the <laughs> dishonored Bioshock like hands in the <laughs> in the foreground. That's cool. All right. Let's see. I wonder if I can get up here or if. I think I might have to go up there and then go down the dock. So let's let's try that. Let's uh actually let's go into this house first. Okay, press E to interact. Gotcha. The mining company made me an offer on the house yesterday. I hear they need better access to the port, and I wish I could just take it and leave, but we ha don't have anywhere else to go. My parents are long past dead, and even if they weren't, the villagers up the hills are getting sick too. The bodies are piling up in the streets. This is the safest place we can be right now. Oh. Oh, you can eat to restore your health. And I am kind of hurt. Good thing there was food just laying out for me. Really appreciated. Nothing, huh? Don't like to store stuff in your storage spaces. That's fine. I burned the last of his possessions today, just as the doctor suggested. He told me that if I don't show any of the symptoms, within a week they will allow me to get my son back. The postman told me the rumors he had heard about the sickness. The people said it came from the mines, although I doubt it originated there. Hmm. I'll eat whatever that was. It was it was food, so I felt felt good to eat. I'm guessing that bread's no good, <laughs> if that is indeed bread. Okay, well we'll, we'll check that out in a sec. There's a photo back there. Can't really uh, see it from here. I didn't mean to break that. I'm sorry. I'm being extremely rude. I didn't expect the house to be this expansive. Another note. Some weird stuff has been happening lately, and I have been hearing strange noises at night. I locked the gate to the yard just in case. Alright, so that means we're gonna have to find a key. At some point. That? Looks, looks like a crowbar or something. Can we... Can we take that? I know, it's a little dark. I guess it's not a crowbar. All right. I must face reality. My husband is gone and we don't have enough money left to last another year. Now that winter is right around the corner and with the roof leaking, I will have to start the repairs this week. It won't get 
fix by itself. When our eldest son turns 12 next month, he'll be strong enough to help with picking olives this year. After that, I'll have to figure something out. I just have to. Everything will be all right. We'll make it. All right, so they're not having a great time. Um, to say the least. Not exactly on vacation here. Okay, so I came out the back. Alright, before we move on, I actually kind of want to check out the dock. Because we skipped that a little bit. So, I, I kind of want to see... I'm not sure what that 0 out of 5 is. But, um... Kind of feeling like I should try at least to complete most of the things in this game. At least most of the objectives. Yeah, okay, this is the gate that was locked they were talking about. So it turns out I don't need a key, I just needed to go through the back door of the house. Alright, here we go, here's another note. I haven't seen the miners for the last two days. I wonder what's going on. I'm grateful for the silence, but the sudden disappearances make me feel uncomfortable. The postman hasn't shown his face this month either. I hope he's all right. He was such a nice man. I'm sure he was. Very nice. All right, we're at full health now. Good to go. Sup? I didn't mean to... Okay, I just... I come in like a bull in a china shop and I wreck everything. Sorry about that. Oh, uh, I guess the the book's just gonna wash out to sea at this point. Sorry. Ugh. Alright, well, I guess we're done there then. Let me, uh, let me check something real quick. I, I don't think that there's voice acting, but just in case there's, um... No subtitles option, so no voice acting. That's what we can, uh, ascertain. Alright, let's go back in the house. And through the back door. Sometimes it's just, it's difficult to know what order you're supposed to do things, you know? Because it's hard to identify the main path and the side path, you know? That is definitely a trap, and I almost walked right into it. I need to be careful. Okay, so now I know to look on the ground. Shit. Oh! That one was set off, not by me. So someone has been here recently. Walk up to a ladder to climb it. Alright, hold your horses. I'm looking around, okay. What was that? What? Something, uh, something's here with me, I guess. We'll climb this ladder. Same thing, I guess. Only use the cargo crane if you really need it. It broke down again last week and won't operate properly ever since. They told me it's got something to do with the compressors. Who knows? I asked the maintenance guys to take a look at it last time, but I guess they don't have any time to spare these days. They must have been too busy cleaning up the spills in the mines. I hear it has been a real mess down there lately. Yeah, probably. What? Oh, wait, I gotta... There we go. Ow! What happened? Oh! Ow! Shoulda... Shoulda looked closer. Damn. Just exploring a bit, okay. Oh, gotcha. Ah ha ha! Nice! Let's do this! I think I want to be over here. Hopefully. 
Now, at this point, watching this, you may think that this is kind of a walking simulator type of thing, where you just walk around and find notes. There's actually some physics-based gameplay from what I read on the Steam Store page. There actually are monsters. Um, I didn't spoil too much of it for myself, obviously, but... Um, very interesting to me that this isn't just... Ooh. Oh, I was hoping we would get a lantern. It isn't just, uh, you know... One of those games that's like, got kind of a creepy atmosphere, but there's not really anything to do. Okay, I think that that's the way that we go. High voltage, no trespassers. Yeesh. Just exploring, sorry. Environments are really well done, really beautiful. I don't know. Sorry guys, sometimes I get in a bad habit of like... I'm like 20 minutes into the game and I'm commentating on like... You know, how it looks and feels and stuff like that when really... I should probably just shut up and play. Comment on that stuff later. Uh, notice of cessation of activities. Due to recent events, all operations at the mine and its accompanying facilities have been suspended indefinitely. Local residents are strongly encouraged to keep a safe distance until further notice. Trespassers will be prosecuted and will be dealt with harshly. You have been warned. Hmm, so mysterious things happened at the mines. People got sick. And uh, now they shut it down. Sorry. Excuse me. Alright, I gotta look out for traps. Oh! Here's this, uh... thing again that was glowing earlier. It looks like pipes... running through the ground. Connecting it to... various unknown things. I don't understand. I just... I touched them! And they exploded! What, what's the deal, man? Alright, trap there. We'll have to avoid that. Alright, I'm doing something. Aha! Be gentle with the steam pressure. The carts break often get stuck. Oh, the carts breaks. Uh, misspelled breaks, sorry. Uh, often get stuck. Use the pressure control to set the speed instead. There's only a few more days left anyway. The administration ordered the sealing of the tunnels next week. We're going home. Mike. Thanks, Mike. Thanks for the update. Uh. Alright, we got the engine roaring. Pressure gauge is up. Keep hands clear from machinery, no problem. Steam, everything's, uh, is everything working? It sounded like everything kind of roared to life in there, so I'm guessing we're... We're good. Oh wait, maybe we don't want that, actually. Danger corrosive materials. Alright, so we want to get... in there. Through that door. Huh. Ow! Oh. Ow, ow, ow! Ow, okay. Alright, so we're doing something here. Gotcha. Okay, maybe I shouldn't, uh... Shouldn't be back here right now, actually. All oh, right, the crank. That did it. Nice. Broke through. Ooh, dude, got a tightrope walker over here. Is able to just kind of. Now is this still? Oh, we're fine now. We're fine. Here we go.
danger. Corrosive materials. We'll hold off on that for a sec. Use radio transmitters to save your progress between autosaves. Okay. Saving. Okay. All right. Cool. This is very, very amnesia so far. Which I, of course, appreciate. I really enjoy that game for obvious reasons that I've talked about a lot. What am I doing up here? Huh. I think that might have been a trap? I don't know. Maybe I just bypassed it? <laughs> I should have listened to the locals. They warned me about the coming storm. I barely made it out alive. Although the directions the fishermen gave me were most helpful, I completely lost my bearings in all the chaos. I should move quickly and find shelter before things get any worse. All right, uh, I'd say the game's off to a strong start so far. All right, are you ready to touch the vase and have it explode? And I don't know, you freaking nudge it and you end up punting it across the room, come on. Oh, why would we want the light off? Let's leave it on. Okay. Here we go. Little, little basic platforming there. Keep out. Authorized personnel, right? Yep. Totally locked. I'm still curious what the uh, canteen or whatever that thing is in the lower left that says zero out of five is for. And that's sparking, so I'm staying away from it. Mike. <laughs> Sorry, my voice cracked. Mike! Mike! As much as we try to get rid of these bloody mushrooms, they keep growing back for some unknown reason. This new guy from the offices took samples today. He's some sort of doctor. He said the mushrooms are toxic and suggests to keep a safe distance. Make sure to use the protective suit if you venture down to the basement. Let's not take any risks! George. I'm going to start calling you Safety George from now on. Come on, man. Live a little. All right. Just some mushrooms. Who cares if Mike wants to eat them? You know, that's his business. Let him have a little fun. Okay. Uh, here we go. Punt the base. <laughs> I don't know why that amuses me so much. All right, fuck your door. Just bypassed everything. All right, I think I can disarm these. Yeah, there we go. Better than just tiptoeing around everything. Turn the steam on, opens the door apparently. Did I miss a note in here? I don't think I did. They're pretty obvious. They're all shiny and stuff. All right, I don't think I I don't think I missed one. Excuse me. All right. Wow, there's a lot of places to go. Okay, so we can go up to the left or to the right, down to the left or just hang out here. We'll go here for now. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh wow, that looks uh, poisonous. We'll avoid that for now. Locked, so we're probably gonna need a key. Sleeping quarters. All right, they probably keep something like that around here. 
Day 334. The lady living in the house down at the beach came by to ask for help today. It's such a shame her husband got the sickness too. She's so beautiful, I would hate to see her cry. We gave her our last restorative. Though it doesn't look like he'll survive the night. Maybe it can ease his pain and we won't be needing it anyway. Thank God it's just two more days left until we can leave this damned place. Hmm. The sickness, huh? I wonder if it's gonna be like uh, some sort of Last of Us. Fungi head type of deal. Fungi? Fung. That's not how you spell it, or uh, how you pronounce it. <laughs> Fungi? No? I know that because I was thinking about it the other day. I was like, how do you pronounce fungi? Uh, oh well. Pronunciation is such a uh, subjective thing, if you ask me. Alright, let's go. What I do? What what happened? We good? I'm just gonna eat that entire can of whatever. Hope that's cool. Oh Yeah, something definitely broke down that door. That was me. That was me. I have very powerful kicks. What can I say? Oh, sure. Right. Yeah, okay. Nice try. You know me, flipping switches, just doing that type of thing, solving puzzles. Day 83. The administration recruited two more locals today. Good fellas, too. Nikos, tall gray hair with a kind of uh, a kind look in his eye, and his 14-year-old son, Manos. The three of us were instructed to stay behind and build solid walls and patch up the ceilings for the abandoned tunnels. I consider that to be a very odd request for a mine. I suspect they have future plans for this place. Hmm. All right, so the, it was abandoned, but now it's, um, no power. All right. Oh, we're back here, are we? Gotcha. Gotcha, did I read this note? I think I did. Yeah, I definitely did. This was uh, George chastising Mike about the mushrooms. I did that. Nothing to worry about. So this is the elevator. Okay, I understand. All right. Hmm. Doesn't open. Okay, so since we've got that open, I bet we can go... See, we already went through here. Can we go through here now? This is green. Alright, we haven't been this way. Sorry, Vase. God. Here are these mushrooms. Hmm. It's red, guys. You know what red means. Are you fucking serious, dude? What was that? Oh, 
Oh, it's probably something in here. Do I have to go in there? Alright. Here goes. Here goes nothing. Should I have done that? Oh. Oh, good. No, no, no. That's definitely what I wanted. Locked. Turned off the steam here. Still not on. <laughs> ow, 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 what, what was? Oh, I guess it's like a periodic. It's like periodic toxicity from the water or something. Although time has been sparse recently, I have finally made a breakthrough in my study of the black liquid. And as I expected, it has uh, much to offer. So far, I've been able to extract an interesting otherworldly substance. It displays incredible restorative properties when applied to organic tissue, although its effects do not seem to be permanent. I am cautiously optimistic that I will be able to refine this matter into a form of medicine that I will be able to administer in a more suitable manner. Further study will show if this is true. I see. The black liquid, huh? I'm sure it will be used only for good, right? What was that? It was like a big daddy or something. Right, I'm just gonna... Just gonna pretend like we didn't see that guy. Excuse me. Got pinched in the door there. Health supplements. Oh! That's what that is. Sup, found a uh, hidden food. Ah, uh, that doesn't look good. Let's save. Day 345. I really don't know what we're still doing here. There's no word from management and no one is answering our calls on the transmitter. We're out of here as soon as we seal the eastern tunnel. They can all go to hell. Yeah. Yeah, you show them. Another health supplement. Okay. Makes me chuckle every time. All right. Wh which way am I supposed to go? Left or right? Let's go right first. We've got all the uh, notes anyway. What? Alright, we're back here. Oh, we need to get the elevator. Right, 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 right. Okay, so that was where I came. Tell you what, no one's gonna interfere with my work. Did it work? Sure did. Alright, let's get inside. Oh, credit sequence. Wow, this far in?
Amazing. No. No, you got it. You got to let me out. We're not going to plunge back down, are we? Guys, I've got a good feeling about this one. <laughs> 